Soyuz Trademark 12 was the 12th expedition to Mir, and included the first Briton in space, Helen Sharman. Topic Crew. Topic Mission Details. The Mir crew welcomed aboard Anatoly Artsbarsky, Sergei Krikalev on his second visit to the station, and British cosmonaut researcher Helen Sharman, who was aboard as part of Project Juno, a cooperative venture partly sponsored by British private enterprise. Sharman's experimental program, which was designed by the Soviets, leaned heavily toward life sciences, her speciality being chemistry. A bag of 250,000 pansy seeds was placed in the KVANT-2 EVA airlock, a compartment not as protected from cosmic radiation as other mere compartments. Sharman also contacted nine British schools by radio and conducted high-temperature superconductor experiments with the Electropograph 7K device. Sharman commented that she had difficulty finding equipment on Mir as there was a great deal more equipment than in the trainer in the cosmonaut city of Zvezdny Gorodok. Krikalev commented that, while Mir had more modules than it had had the first time he lived on board, it did not seem less crowded, as it contained more equipment. Krikalev also noted that some of the materials making up the station's exterior had faded and lost color, but that this had had no impact on the station's operation. The spacecraft spent 144 days docked to Mir. While it was in orbit, the failed coup d'état against Mikhail Gorbachev rocked the Soviet Union, setting in motion events which led to the end of the Soviet Union on December 26, 1991. 